Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are back again and we finally got ourselves back to a three streak, which is always nice to see. And we're going to jump in for another randomize and see who we get. Nice. Boss Russian Mother is okay. But yeah, Bear Tainted Lilith should be an easy-ish run. Obviously Mother makes things a little harder. Was it... Last episode, we did Mass Stemmer to Mother. I can't remember. But that was a that was a good run. Uh, ooh, new item and uh, Lost Soul. So after each third completed room, spawn a random weak familiar, such as a Dip, Blood Claw, or Fly. If a boss room is a room where a friendly type would pay out, it spawns a random charmed monster instead. Do you know what? That's a new item from, I believe, Repentance Plus. I love the idea of it, especially... The fact that it can spawn clots, that is intriguing to me. Oh, God. Uh, very intriguing to me indeed. It being able to spawn clots is great. Ooh. Um, a reflected soul of blue baby is kind of interesting there, but I don't think we particularly need that right now. Um, soul of blue baby is one of those ones that, like, if it didn't drop bombs all over the floor, every other aspect of it is really good, but it does drop bombs all over the floor. So it's kind of like, eh. Don't really know the best uh, usage of that. But yes, uh, I'm recording again for like the third time today. I tend to get into like certain moods where I'm really into recording Isaac. And because Isaac's, Isaac's such a good series to... Oh, there he goes, a clock boy. Um, because Isaac is such a good series to backlog, um, I find that it really... Um, it's, it's, just, it's just a game where I'm in the mood to play it. Just generally, it's like, why not record it? Like, why play it off camera when I could be recording? But yeah, um... I'm kind of excited to be jumping into this. But yes, uh, as for the regular, the the sort of more, something that I'm trying to at least do a little more commonly. Ooh, fragmented card, nice. Um, with sort of the question of the episode for you guys, today's is what, if any, would be a modded item idea that you'd love to see, like an item idea of yours, or maybe just one that you've seen on Reddit or on another, someone else mentioned that you really like the idea of, that you'd really love to see. Just like a single item, be it active um, or be it uh, passive. What would be an item that you'd just absolutely love to see? Also, we got a black fly here. Is that a, like a locust, maybe? I'm not exactly sure what that is. Might be a custom fly for this item. I'm not sure. It's kind of annoying because we got a bunch of keys behind uh, closed doors there that we can't get to. Okay. Where's the last one of you? Oh, there you are. Hello. Ooh, there you go. Okay, so we've got a bomb now. Let's go and bugger off. Oh, we get mini Isaacs as well. Oh, I love this item. Will this... Do this better reveal both of these. Okay, it did. Good. Um, we got a mini Isaac as well. Do you know what? I'm in love with this. This is such a cool item. Um, lasts for the floor. Do you know what? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Why not? And it even spawns modded ones too. This is going to be a very familiar heavy run, apparently. But yeah, it'd be really cool to see what sort of item ideas you guys have had that you'd really love to see implemented. One that I've always had, like, in the back of my head that I'd love to see is I feel like bombs in combat don't really get a lot of love. Like, there's definitely a lot of good combat bomb items, but, like, you don't end up using them that in that many runs. So I'd love to see a few new combat-focused um, bomb items. And one that I've always had an idea of would be really fun is like a money equals power, but for bombs, where essentially the more bombs that you have, the more damage your bombs do. Um, and like, if you have 99, they do more and more. But then that, then that of course, means the more bombs that you use, the less that they do. So do you want to save multiple bombs to try and get... Ooh, we also get... Um, Golden fragmented card here, which could be interesting. Nice. We get golden bombs as well there. Probably not going to go devil deal here. I just want to quickly drop my fragmented card real quick. Uh, plus one extra secret room per floor. Okay, it's regular secret room. I just wanted to make sure of that um, just to check. But yes, um, I'd really love to see one that, yeah, had a, like a scaling bomb damage, depending on how many bombs you are... Uh, you are holding. I think that could be really interesting. Excuse me, little boy. Get out of my way. Let's try and blow up these. There you go. Get some pennies in there. That's nice. I don't know how to feel about the um, the monsters it spawns, but we'll take it. We'll take it. Remember, there's going to be an extra secret room here, so we want to be checking everywhere we can. Here's second secret room. And this is one of mine, I do believe. This is um, one of the uh, secret rooms from my pack. It's the basement secret room. 
because there's lots of poop on the basement. And obviously it's a basement layout as well. It was really fun making those, actually. I'm, I'm thinking of doing... Oh, wait, that might not have been quite in line. I'm thinking of doing another one of those for... Um, for what's it called? Ooh, nice. I'm getting really confused by this uh, this charmed enemy right now. I kind of want to kill him. <laughs> um, well, I'm going to see if I can kill him. One minute. Let's let's see if, what's the best way to do this. Okay, 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 okay. Put a bomb there. And then how on earth do I separate him from me? There you go. And then... <laughs> I'm sorry, fella. You're just getting in the way and you're being very annoying. Generally just an annoying little fella. Uh, but yeah, like I've been thinking of doing a, another mod like I did for my um, thingy one for curse rooms. I think it'd be really fun. I honestly don't know where the hell the secret room is. I'm really, I'm really lost. Like there's supposed to be an extra secret room and I've not even found one yet. What the hell's going on? It's got to be here, right? Well, there's one. Um, I'll take pills. Why not? Short speed down. Don't really care about that. Health up's pretty good. Cyanide. And we get cyanide, which gives us uh, a black heart. Okay, so where's the other secret room then? I don't think we have one on this floor. I've got to admit, I don't think we do. Check this real quick. Ooh, we got birthright. Birthright on this character is genuinely just really fun. We actually had it recently. Uh, but on top of it just being normally really fun anyways, it's going to be even more fun with all the stuff we've got going on right now. So for one, the sack is stuck to it. But for two, Monster Manuel is going to um, be generating familiars for us per floor. So we're going to get all sorts of good stuff going on with this. I was really hoping we'd find Birthright on this run actually. So cool to see. Uh, but anyways, we'll, uh, we'll head down out of this floor. We don't need to be here no longer. And see what we can do. Cares of rebirth. Okay, gotta be gotta be aware. Sometimes when we kill an enemy, it'll be reborn. There you go, exactly like that. It's not gonna happen that often, and it does have a very clear indicator, so we don't really have to worry about it too much. But it's still something we've got to note. I'm ready for your polties. It's always anno annoying when the polties end up creating a bunch of the, uh, the the skaters. But this is gonna generate. Oh, we got um little chub. See, th this is a this is a pretty interesting synergy. Now, now all I need is like the electric dice or something. Which, by the way, electric dice last episode did unfortunately um, like it, it wasn't working, but it has since been fixed. Uh, I um, I let the mod author know, and they didn't say it did in fact say yep, it is indeed broken. Perfections there. Uh, do you know what? Let's carry perfection for now. I do think I probably want fragmented card more. Um, just because I, I like the idea of that a little more, but we'll, uh, we'll go anyways. Um, we need our bombs here, so, do you know what? Let's play out the floor. I might want to buy a bomb. I've got to, I've got to play this a bit safe, because I might want to buy that bomb. Because if I can't get down to the next floor, you're going to have a bad time. Um, also, would like flight now, because there is some really good stuff behind there. And just a minute, we can get flight pretty easily. Okay, good. Oh, hello, reflected chest. Right, let's pop in here. Forget me now, unfortunately, no. I don't know what this does. Well, it got rid of perfection, I can tell you that. I think it did some damage to us and gave us a burn heart. That's fair. I'm actually okay with that. Uh, but let's go get our fire. Let's pop this as well, actually. Why not? Fills up the burn heart a little. And then we can get our fire, which allows us to get all this good stuff. In fact, we can even get into our cash room here as well. Grab that. Grab that. Stay away from me. Right. Back we go. Okay. So we're going to get an extra spirit heart here. Unfortunately, it's a sticky nickel. We do get a spin down dice shard, which... Obviously is potentially very good. In fact, I think I'm just gonna I'm just I'm just gonna try my luck at spinning down this. It'll spin down into calcium. Should we give it a go? Why not? 
Grants one empty burn heart container. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, look at that. Pretty decent damage up there. I like it. Right, now we go through our mirror dimension. Do, does anyone remember what boss we fought? It was Min Min, wasn't it? I'm pretty sure we can fight that again without dying. I'm almost certain we can. We're getting a, a lot of empty rooms here as well, which is always nice. Oh, I did say I was going to get the uh, the mod that removes the chase sequence before I went to Mother again. Unfortunately, I've uh, forgotten to do that. I really wish I had done now, but it's fine. Okay, so Rebirth helping us out a little bit there. We Oh, we got a Wisp from our sack, th I think, there. You can get a lot of interesting stuff from these sacks by the looks of it. I'm really liking this. I'm not going to bother using my book now. I just don't think it's that worthwhile. Like, we're doing so much damage right now. Like, even the Rebirth enemies, are, some of them are dying, like, literally instantly. Like, we're hitting them and instantly killing them. Yeah, look at that. That's just a free item right there. And we got the Wooden Horn, too. What Wooden Horn's a very, very good uh, boss item. Right, unfortunately, we didn't get any extra bombs throughout that process, which is really what I was hoping for. Um, we did get some extra money, though. So, oopsie, wrong way. Uh, I think we, we've got a ticket on the nose. I'll uh, at least pop out these poops. Nothing from them. Yeah, and we can, we can go and grab ourselves some good stuff. I think I'm more than willing to do this. Because we're going to get money out of it, which is great. But more importantly, we now have two golden chests to play around with. I did not mean to get hurt there. God damn it. Crumpled ticket. Not for me. Yeah, crumpled ticket's not for me. Unfortunately, that didn't really provide us with any benefits. And in fact, was wholeheartedly negative. But we did get some money out of it from our golden hearts. So I think we buy a bomb. And I think, even though it's a soul heart, I think we keep rolling here. And try and get some good shop stuff going on. Like the stopwatch. Good stuff. Gotta love that stopwatch. Right, now we can go to the next floor feeling happy and dandy and safe. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. I was like, where the hell's my knife piece? And I'm like, oh yeah, shit. My, um... I think he's carrying it. The, the birthright effect is carrying it. <laughs> but yeah, it's going to be interesting that we're going to be getting different... Um, different familiars within our birthright effect each floor. It's going to be really cool. Something I can get behind. This time we get Rotten Baby. Which unfortunately isn't a contact damage familiar. But still, I am not displeased in any way, shape or form. Yeah, this, this sack familiar thingy, really cool. Anyone remember how to... Ah, okay. I see. Oh, bad hit, bad hit. I was very confused by that room for a second there, but I got the hang of it. I already checked that, didn't I? Gonna leave that pill right where it stands. God damn, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just in a good mood today, and this run is definitely helping with that. This is a very fun run. We've got a lot of interesting stuff going on. Fun build. It's nice and strong. I don't have to worry too much about my survival. I like these runs where it's like, I only got, I only kind of got to sort of, ow, um, the situation that I'm in by kind of, it wasn't a lot of thinking, but by, by sort of thinking about ways that runs could work together and things could, could work alongside each other. Um, but at the same time, I've gotten to the point where I don't have to be hyper-focused on the run to be able to play it effectively. Can you, can you stop, sir? Thank you, Mushroom. And we can pop this again, and then who do we get this time? We got Melon, baby! Hell yes! The turtle melon's in the hoose! But yeah, contact damage familiars are always going to be the better ones, but these, this still, this still pops off pretty hard. This is still my jam, heavily. But yeah, you can see the damage from Little Chub to this, the damage is like so much lower, but still. So we're hoping for actual familiars to, as items though as well, but this is this is a good uh, facsimile of what we could be seeing. We get ourselves an angel, baby. I don't you know what, I'll keep you around. Nice tears up, which is great. 
and we get ourselves an angel deal. The mitre, I, fe I feel like I get the mitre from my angel deals a lot. It's not a bad thing, to be honest. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> and it's gone. I love that meme. And it's gone. River Greed is, is certainly tempting. I wish I had more bombs so I could make use of my, uh, my golden trinket a little more. That's good. <laughs> that is very good. That is a huge damage up. Yeah, we'll, cheer, we'll, we'll save this charge for the next floor. I love that. Look at little turtle melon baby. Here he goes. Whip that bitch. Whip him about. What? Ah. Oh my god. I am taking a bit too much damage. This room. This room I'm nerping out of. I remember going in this room before and I hurt myself on it so much. I'd rather spend a bond, I'm sorry. Right. Let's go. Uh, shall I pop in here? Nah, I'd, I'd rather stay my two keys for the next floor. Right, away we go. Oh, I've got a pink, um, pink lemonade Lucasade Zero. Very happy with it right now. What we get this time. Um, Ghost Baby, okay. I was like, what the hell baby is that? What the hell is even that? But it's just Ghost Baby. Well, yeah, it's been a little while since I've had Cricket's uh, head. Very happy about that. Will this reach? Yes. We get Small Rock. This run is so blessed. Cricket's head straight after followed by Small Rock. So blessed. Give me that mini Isaac. Sword M80. No, thank you. Yeah, I really wish we had a higher source of bomb income. I really want to be looking for secret rooms at all, like, pretty much all times, every floor, but I just don't really have the ability to do so. Birdcage. Now, Birdcage is a familiar, but Birdcage is a familiar that's only active once we've been hit, so let's take this instead. And that's better, because now GB Bug's attached to that, which I don't even know how this is going to work. It literally rewrote. That's funny. Oh, that's hilarious. I know that was a half soul heart. I really shouldn't have tested it on a half soul heart. But we now have... We now... <laughs> it's really funny, actually. Uh, what, what, what we got now? Foil Baby. Foil Baby's pretty good. Um, we, we now have this thing. <laughs> like, this ranged reroll, so to say. Oh, this is funny. I really like this room design. Especially when there's a tinted rock. Game. <laughs> you little shitbag. It <laughs> You little fucker. What? It just re-rolled these bombs into a reverse moon card. You are forgiven, game. What the fuck? <laughs> what have I created here? What have I created? This is some... Stop! I... Okay. So, something I've figured out, which is inconvenient, to say the least. Um, so, because our familiars are stored inside Lilith now, when we walk over a pickup, it is automatically rerolled whether we fire or not. Which just seems dandy, doesn't it? Just seems dandy. Right. Let's use our moon card. Why not? BFF. Hell yes, BFF. Whoa. A lot of soul hearts there, buddy. My goodness. What the hell? Yeah, I just picked up the soul... Uh, and it turned into something else. So if I walk out of this room, back in, and pick up a coin. Okay, I don't, I don't think it refreshes unless I, be, I go to a completely new room. Some weird stuff going on right now. We have seen the shop. Okay, have we seen all of our rooms? We have not. We got some strange things happening. I've got to try and remember that. One moment. Right, let's keep her going. 
We need to get our... Uh, I can't believe we got BFF. I'm so happy. Look how big our boys are. Look how big our crew is now. Watch this. I want a key. Nope, it's a red hat. <laughs> That's so funny. GB bug is GB bugged. And I think that's so funny. You watch how many times am I going to forget that throughout this run and be just so upset when I reroll something great. I like pick up a trinket or something just I really want. And it's like, game's like, nah. <laughs> Screw you. Right. Let's do this whole song and dance again. And not not just... No, not just like normal. We have lower speed because we, we are T. Lilla. By the way, can I just say, this isn't something that matters at all. Like, at all. And I really, it really shouldn't bother me. But for some reason, I, I really don't like it when people call them the B-side characters. It's like, t just call them tainted characters or T character, like T dot whatever. Like B-side and then people are on about tarnished characters being C-side and it's just like, eh. I don't know. I don't like it. I don't like it. I really don't know what it's what it is about it. It's honestly, just oh god damn it. Me just being a goober, I think. But oh, don't you hate it when you don't quite throw the bomb far enough? I hate these red bombs in this area. Piss me off so much. Uh, to be fair, I'm just really bad with them. This is a nice, unique area. I do wonder is this one modded or vanilla? Just charge, you fucking fat cow. Oh, re look at that. Look how far. Look how far he decided to throw that bomb. Ooh, this one's easy for us because we have a... We have a really, really easy way to destroy poops. But yeah, this is a nice, unique one. I, I, li I like these sort of ones. These ones are a bit more fun. Yeah, like I said, I don't know if this is modded or not. Did not realise yet. Did not realize that's how I was meant to do this puzzle. Oh, god damn it. Go away, you big ugly shit. Right, we outie. Let's go. Right, we have red hearts all about, which should be good. Let's try and look for some secret rooms here, though, first. Um, very plausibly here. In fact, yeah, who's it? I felt like it was almost definite. I don't know if you guys can see it, but... There's a line where I'm stood right here. I'm walking into it now. There's a line with a texture. Like, you can see it over here as well, actually. There's a line where, in fact, let me check this theory. Oh, okay. There's a line where the texture doesn't join. And I saw that texture and was like, that doesn't quite look right. Something looks wrong there. Oh, we can get into our secret room from here, though. Our secret room, cash room. Pick up a pill. Oh, I thought it was going to re-roll it. It didn't. GB bug. Why don't you re-roll things anymore? There you go. Give me that key. Thank you for your services, GB bug. What was in a shop? Can't be anything that good, right? Have I been to my shop? I haven't. Okay. Well, there you go then. I was like, hmm. Must have been like a greed fight or something. I never even had a look. Fanny pack isn't really cutting my cheese right now. Ooh. The hand-me-downs. A speed up. After your run ends, three random items from your inventory are spawned on the floor where it ended. They can be collected in your next run. That seems really good, but if you don't die mid-run, it's not very good. But a cool item nonetheless. Uh, Empress. Nice. And do you know what? Let's go for a reroll like this as well. Smelter is good. I might as well pick it up just to smelt this. Grab that as well. Yeah. I'm pretty happy with that. As it goes, I'm pretty happy. Like, let's go down. We've got a full knife now, haven't we? Yeah, so we're going to be doing absolutely insane damage now, by the way. Because once we have that knife, it's going to go hard. Obviously only for this floor, but still. Right, let's see who we get. Oh, we got... I think we just got Succubus there. Yeah, we did. Succubus is going to do his own thing. Live in his own life. But we've got the knife now, so... We saw this in a previous episode. It, it really does a lot of damage. 
Oh, I forgot. GB bug. Why do you have to curse me this way? This is... Oh, this is actually quite an intriguing little puzzle here. Well, not puzzle, but like... What the hell is this thing? Okay. All right, let me pick up that key that time. Boom. That bomb rerolled into a bomb. Even my mini Isaacs get BFF'd. It's great. Ooh, wait. So we go boom, boom. Crack that. And then boom. And we go through there. And that highlights that. Ah ha ha ha. Ooh, we got a zealot heart as well. But I, I, I... There you go, I got it. Basically a zealot heart from what I remember at least. Essentially, if we can manage to keep it... Um, until the next floor, we get two Lamageddon Wisps, which is pretty good. Doesn't seem too overpowered either. There you go. But yeah, if we get hit, we lose it. So we've got to not get hit until the next floor. It's kind of something you should really leave on the floor for as long as possible. Reroll that heart into a penny. This, do you know what? This should be an item. An item that makes it so the first item you walk into every room is automatically rerolled. It's kind of like a cursed item. You don't really want it, but it's kind of interesting to have. Oh, we got, uh, is that Rover Baby 2.0? That can't be, right? That doesn't look right. No, what the hell? It is. He looks really funky. Loki's horns. Let's roll on that. Ooh. It's too good not to. It's too good not to. We lost some damage for the burn hearts, but three free hits per floor, we've got a zealot heart. Sounds very nice. It has also seemingly turned off our music, which is eerie. Judas's tongue. No thank you, no thank you. Nine volt would be awesome. Too bad I spent all my money. Right, trying to think, where can we get more money here? Well, there's a start. Let's go back over here and go to these rooms this way. I'm almost certain this isn't the boss fight. Maybe we'll do our curse room as well. Not curse room, sorry, yeah, boss trap room. M mob trap room, even. I'll get there eventually. Don't reroll my money, game. Don't mock me. Oh, my God. The most frustrating thing. Right, who do we get this time? Um, some sort of angel. Seraphim, I think. Got a bit of Seraphim. Ow. I was telefragged. Um, we can make this work. Eee, that is one pe no, two penny shot. Let's grab that for now. We'll see if we can crack the key into somewhere nice. We'll, what, we, maybe we'll just use it to find the secret room, which I believe to be here. There you go. So hard, at least I'll take it. Oh, we got a golden, a golden clock. Right. See if we can find another secret room using this thing. Could be there. Very easily could be here. There it is. And there's our pennies. Oh, hell yes. And then I think we can crack key pretty soon. Gimme, gimme. Yeah, let's crack key here. It's a shame, unfortunate, but whatever. Right. Keep it going. Don't really care about my cards and stuff that I had before. Not quite sure what this room is. Uh, it looks like it's not that hard of a room, actually. It's just a bit weird looking. Not unlike myself. I did manage to accidentally re-roll one of these guys while I was invincible there. One of the little cultist dudes. Look at this damage, though. It's beefy. Foul gut. Now, I have no idea what this is going to do, but I'm going to pick it up anyways. 
Please don't kill me. Okay, it worked. I was just wanting the burn hearts. I, di I didn't know if um, if the, the blue blood thing made it so that we would um, have only soul hearts forever. I couldn't remember. Anyways, let's go down. Uh, let's pop this and see who we get. We got... I don't know. Oh, Cuba meat. Ugh. Dull. Big ball. Big snooze. Ah, oh, it really into a chest though. Can't be mad about that. But yeah, we got the Lemma Get and Wisp there. It seems like we got... Uh, there's options and leprosy by the looks of things. And you see, we've still got the Zealot Heart, so for every flaw that we keep it, we get two Lemmageddon Wisps. It can be pretty strong, but they seem reasonably rare. I think they're, I think they're a very good idea. And I think they can be lost in a single hit as well, so that makes them not too strong. Not the Wisps, I mean. I mean the actual Zealot Heart itself. Who do we get this time? Oh, Turtle Baby's back again. Hell yeah. Hit me. Ah, shit. He's doing a good job as well. He's sweeping the leg. Oh, I'm going to be so sad to lose our knife, though. It's going to lower our DPS by a good bit. It wouldn't be, like, drastic. We can't... Soy milk's fun. We cannot take it, though. Because the thing is with soy milk, it lowers our whipping damage. And our whipping damage is a lot of our damage. We got companion cube, which... Oh, I was so hoping it'd be attached to our... To our whipping uh, damage. That'd be so funny. Go, my minions. Boom, and boom, and aww. So nearly, so nearly one-cycled. Right, uh, obviously we'll grab this. Take a little look over here. Shoots tears at enemies, increased number of tears fired when you take damage. It's a familiar, but it's not the halo. The halo's better. Right, knife is gone. As you can see, the damage has gone down a bit, but... We're still doing do certainly good damage. By no means bad at all. Right. Down down we go. Hopefully we can get some good familiars on the last floor. I do apologize about my chair, by the way. It's it's very creaky. I really do apologize. Hey, I got a 5G cell phone here. I think that's one of my Lemma getting Wisps, right? And then Pyro, I think. And we'll pop this. And we got... Who do we get? I do not know. Seemingly no one. Sad. This, uh... This Holy Bernie is like... doing some crazy shit. God damn, when we're in the holy when we're in the holy dips aura, we can whip so fast. We've already got so many charges already, what the hell? They're probably throwing me off. Every time I walk into the dip, I get like a massive fire rate boost. And this time we get Lil Steven. Nice. Right, speed through this floor. Oh, I love the Dumpy's look on this floor. They look so good. We don't actually have a trinket right now, so I should probably take the uh, missing page, but it's cool. Oh, I re-rolled him into a haunt. I don't know what she's more annoying. That has less health, so probably not that. And then we get... We get this time. Oh, a little chub again. L little chub's really good, because it's all contact damage. As you can see, he's performing very well. 
Am I getting to see clots we never normally get to see? It's great. I wish there was more items that gave you mini Isaacs. Like on the regular. I know there's the, there's the cheese grater one where it removes a heart container, gives you, gives you some health and spawns some mini Isaacs. But they're just temporary. You can't, you can't get them like regularly. Oh, we've got Bob's brain in there, dude. Bob's brain in there? Isn't that like amazing, right? Nope. <laughs> Immediately regret what I just said there. Now, it should be pretty good if we can make it work. But it's, it's literally like a, a bomb on a stick, right? There you go. Ordinary life. It's good stuff for me. Extra tears up. And we move forward. Okay, let's pop this, see what we get. We got... Uh, Brother Bobby. Eh, whatever. It's not bad, it's not good. We'll see what life sorts us out with. Please don't die, little dip. You are my saving grace. You are my hero, and I cherish you. I think I just re-rolled that dude into a bomb, somehow. <laughs> I really don't know how, how how that would have happened, but that was de definitely what it looked like happened. Oh shit, I just realized there's a lot of other enemies in this room. Wait, what? Oh. And then we pop this again, and we get... What we got this time? Is that Boil Baby under there? There's definitely something red under there. Also, this Zealot Heart... That we uh, we don't have it anymore actually, but the zealot heart that we had propped a lot. We got four lemmigetting wisps that we still got. I think burn hurting juice was giving us some good stuff. Where where are these bombs coming from? Yeah, I think burn hurting juice giving us some good stuff. Ooh, not that we're likely to not that we're likely to get one, but that's pretty good. Ooh, I hate this room. I hate this room. I get hit on it every single time. Oh whoa! Why can't I be hurt by those? What item do I have that's doing that? Whatever it is, I'm very grateful. I'm looking through my item list now and trying to figure out what that would be. I really don't know. What would give us spike protections? Maybe it's the uh, the calcium. Let, let me let me go and have a little look see and just see if it is. Try to think of what it could be. Inventory. Oh, oh, we actually have Jelly Belly. As one of our wisps, of one of our Lemmigetten wisps, and I just didn't notice. And we just got really lucky in that every single time that would have procked it instead gave us a belly jelly proc, and that's why it made the sound. That makes a lot more sense now, because I was like, oh cool, they've used the belly jelly sound. Nope, we just got belly jelly. And what we got this time. Cannot tell. Again, it's something. It's something that's contributing to our success. That's all I care about. Nice. I can't believe this Bernie dude's been with us this whole time. Right. Down we go. This should be a pretty easy boss fight for us here. Like, we've got really good health. We've still got, I think... Two or three hits this floor before we start actually taking damage. I think it's just two. God damn, look at all the fires that guy's launching into that that uh, the boss's arm there. One of my lemon getting wisps took a hit there. Looks to be belly jelly. We can actually aim the Bernie dude. We're aiming all the fires in just the right spot too, so. I like it. Oh, tainted lily. Tainted Lilith Birthright is like one of my new most fun things. I'm really enjoying it. I've had it two times now and both times. In fact, I've had it back to back of the two times that I played her recently. And both times it's been an absolute blast. That's another hit. Whoopsie, that bomb is gone. I love slowing him down with the bomb. It's such a cool little feature. Okay. 
We are good to go, ow. Cool, we're good. There you go. What an absolutely stellar run. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next one.